Alright guys, welcome back. Let's do... Let's finish this up and do um, an assault on these guys. So, let's go to the sequence of play. We're going to do command phase. Nothing. The second is mode determination. Let's get everybody that we want to do an assault. Because with assault, you can do multi-assaults. So after one assault, you can do somebody else come in for an assault. So this guy can come in and assault if he loses. Then this next group can come in and do an assault. And then this group until we eliminate that unit. We'll keep these guys in fire mode. We'll keep them in fire mode and we'll bring these guys in assault. All right. Now we're going to do a suppressive fire phase. Let's see who fires first. The Germans get to fire first. I will fire with these guys. They're just going to be a regular 10. So they get a plus one. And it's going to be a minus two to their roll. Uh, seven minus two is a five. And then the other guy using the hex. Six minus two is a four, it's a miss. So they missed. We will fire at this guy. So that's um, five with two away, so that's gonna be a 10, they get a plus one. They're in the building, so no modifier, so plus one modifier. We roll the 9, plus 1 is a 10, they take a hit. Alright, so they took a hit. They are part of the 2. Okay, so they have three morale. Well, company morale, they have a three. So three, three is a six, eight. So it's an eight. They're gonna have a plus one to their roll. Um, five is a six, they're good. So that's all that happened to them. Germans with fire. Four times three is 12, so they get a plus one. And they're in a city, minus three, so the minus two. First one misses, second one, uh, both miss. So they're both missing. All right, they can't fire anymore. Everybody has fired, we are done. Since we're not doing artillery, we're going to get into movement. So these guys will now move. Let's do this guy. One, two. First, they can get the fire um, since they moved for Overwatch. Let's start with that first. Roll the seven. Um, so let's see what we have first before I do anything. So we're going to have 5 times 3 is 15, so you get a plus 1. And they're moving in the city, so they get another plus 1, so 7 becomes a 9, so they get, they take a step loss. Um, they are part of... So their company morale right now is at a four. So they're at a four company morale and they have a three. So they have a seven, eight, nine. What's the modifier on a morale nine? Plus two to morale roll. Nine plus two, eleven. They are suppressed. So they can't go any further. So they were stopped at the door before they could enter. So they got suppressed.
they're gonna fire back. Um, they'll fire back actually. Actually, both of them can fire. They are. Can both fire back. I want to get to the place where I don't have to look at the rules anymore. I know it. That's right. More than one unit may fire caused by one trigger as long as you have a line of sight. So we can. All right, so we're four and three is going to be a 12, and they're a 10. So that's 22. So they get a plus two to their roll. They're in a C is minus three, so minus one to the roll. So the first one we roll is a nine, minus one is an eight. So we get a hit on this guy. So he takes a hit. He is part of the M company. So he's a three, he's a five. So roll a nine, he is suppressed. Next guy up with a minus one. He rolled an eight minus one is a seven. So we just missed on that guy. Do this, so I don't get it confused with um, the suppress. So that goes here, here. This group is suppressed, and he's not. All right, so what happened was he fires, suppressed this guy, then these units fired back and suppressed him. Or well, one of them at least. So this guy cannot assault. So let's bring the next guy in. So he'll go one, two, three. This guy can only fire. He's a three times three is a nine. Nine is going to give him a plus one, plus two because he's moving in the city. So I rolled a four, plus two is a six, so it's a miss. So he didn't get a chance to hit him. These guys, plus I'm going to bring the mortar, are going to fire on this. So I think I had, let's see again, 12, 10, it's 22, plus eight is a 30. So we're gonna get a plus three, minus three. So we're in a wash. Six miss. So we have a miss. One, two, three. He was able to fire. The mortar can fire because my observer was in within three. We didn't have to, uh, anyway, when you're a phasing player, which we are, you don't have to roll for permission to um, overwatch. It is the non-phasing player that has to roll for permission. All right, what's next? So, oh, so we're gonna continue on. So he got to here. So we went one, two, three. <coughs> And then he's going to go into that hex for four. So they can fight or flee. That's, um, that's a mechanic they have. <clears throat> they're going to decide to fight. Since they're going to fight, they're going to fire.
so he's a three. This guy's going to be halved and halved. So I wonder how that works. So he's halved, he's a one. Then he's a one halved again, so he's a five. I mean a point five. <clears throat> but I don't think you get to round up. It's point fifty one that you get to round up. So he's a zero, so he doesn't even count. So basically we have a three. We're firing the same hex, so it's times five. So we're at fifteen, so we get a plus one. We get another plus three because of um, assault. So we have a plus four. Firing on these guys who are coming in the hex. Uh, we roll a six plus four is a ten, so they get hit. This guy is the eighty-nine six. So, company morale is a 5, 8, 9, 10. Wow. You can see when, when your morale starts going up, what happens. We're on this column here, not column, but uh, row. And we are on, what do I have, a 6 plus, no, what did I say, we are, hold on guys, his morale is a 5 plus 3 is an 8, 9, 10, so 9, 10, and where are we? So it's a plus two. If we were here, you can be a plus five. Look how quick that goes up on your modifier. So it's just a plus two modifier. All right, so he took a step loss. He has a minus two to this roll. I mean a plus two to this roll. Five plus two is seven, and that is a suppress. So here's what happens on a suppress. You roll one dice, one d6. You gotta, if you roll equal to your morale and less, the unit will uh, retreat back to the hex it came from. Now, already we are a five company plus a three, that's eight. I wonder if it's just the unit's morale. I'm gonna go, it's that based upon this number and not adding the company morale to it. So let's just go based upon that and I'll look it up later on. So I have to roll higher than a three. I have to roll a four, five, or a six. I roll a three. So they have to leave the hex. Um, so this is the hex we were attacking. So they go back and they're suppressed in that hex. So they were able to repel them out. All right, next guy up. One, two, three. So when we get here, he'll fire. Let's just roll to see if any damage happens. Nine. He is going to take a hit. He's a two. All right, so that's the six part of the 150. So that morale, company morale is at six. So six, company morale plus three is nine, 11. 11 it is still a plus two. Five plus two is a seven. He also suppresses this guy. So he didn't even get into the hex. He suppressed them right before. Ah, oh, they're holding off everybody. <sighs> By the way, I should have been firing it at them. 
every time they made that fire. So let's fire back at this guy. Um, so it's 30. We, we're going to fire 30. I'm not going to fire it twice. I'm just going to fire it at one time. So we have a plus three, so it's a, a zero modifier. We roll a nine, it's a hit on this guy. So he gets hit. He has a four, seven, eight, nine. It's a plus two, that's five, so he is Suppressed as well. So most likely from before he would never suppress the second guy because he would have been suppressed. Let's see what happens with this guy. Killed. So that guy was killed off. This guy is left in the hex. So basically, this guy here, who started here, he would have still been at one. Because when this guy went this way, Unit. When he got into this hex, he was fired on, and then he went into this hex here, fort and got knocked back. But when he got fired on, these guys were supposed to fire at him, leaving now this guy to go one, two, three, four. And since now they're in the hex, now he can do his. Um, he can fire on them. So he's going to fire at them. He's halved and halved again. So he's going to be a one times five. So he's a five. That's no modifiers. And he does get a plus one because this guy's moving in the city. So he's going to get a plus one to his roll. Those are five, six, nothing happens. Oh, he gets a plus three for assault. So he gets actually a plus four. So we roll the five, which is a nine. He does get a hit. So he hits him. Now we check three, six, nine, ten, eleven. and he is suppressed. Yes, yeah, so we want to get to that place when we war game. Everything's natural. We don't have to worry about rules. We know it as best as possible, like 98%. Um, so he's suppressed. So let's see, he's a three. I have to roll four, five, or six to stay. Uh, roll a three, so he gets knocked out as well. So it's piling up. So all these guys are being taken out by this one last platoon. Let's bring this guy around. So he's going to go into this hex. He cannot fire because he's suppressed. Then he goes in here. He fires at him. Again, um, we have firepower five. That's no modifiers, but he gets plus three for the assault. Oh, and plus one because he's moving. So plus four. Oof. 10 plus four is 14. 14. 
two steps and two to company morale. He kills this guy. These guys are eliminated. Wow. Wow. All right, there you go, gentlemen. This one American has held off. Well, everything's done. Let's let's get rid of all the suppressed markers. Let's take a look at what's left. All right, let's do this. It's been a bloodbath. So let's look at what we have. So this platoon is at half strength. It's so lost half of their strength, half of their men. And this as well. And this as well. So these guys here are all at half strength. Trying to make that assault going in one at a time this guy is at half strength holding on and being in a city he gets a minus three in fire mode so he's not dug in if he was dug in he would get a minus five and this unit here um, still has three strength three strength points left so he's in decent shape this guy's full strength he has four strength points left. And we have the mortar at the bottom. So, um, yeah. All right. We know he's not going to survive. Not going to bother with this anymore. We'll surround him. Or we'll just come with this big stack and do some damage on him. All right, guys. I just wanted to play that really quick. That was about 22 minutes. I will talk to you guys later.